This game features themes of abuse, sickness, death. Left click to accept and progress test. Got it. There's a storm approaching right on cue. Is this father? Father up in the corner? It's a Sunday evening. You can only hope this will be the last. Left click to wake up. Mom? Uh, okay. Let's right click to open the interface. Wait, hold space or right click. Alright. Uh, when the interface is active, left click on objects to interact. Oh, sorry, Lana. I didn't mean to wake you. I must have been thinking out loud again. Good timing. We're almost there. I know that the surgery took a lot out of you. I think getting you back home will make all the difference. It's important for you to be with Mother. Mm. To remind you of how things used to be. This doesn't sound very good. If all goes well, I have faith that you'll be able... You'll be back to your old self by the end of the week. You've been through a lot. I'm just glad we got you out of that place. It wasn't good for your head. This sounds like uh, some Silent Hill music. Almost like uh, Night in the Town. This is not an ending! You know, Liana? Father turns down the radio. I have a good feeling about this week. I know I've been so busy at work recently. To tell you the truth, it shames me that I don't have as much time to see my family as I used to. I just want you to know something. Everything we do is for you. Oh god, this doesn't sound... This sounds a little creepy here. I'll give you a call on Thursday evening. Remember to keep an ear out for my call. The house is just up here on the right. I think we went into a tunnel. Just in time for nightfall. <laughs> Dad, don't! Don't leave me! What are you doing? Right. Well, here we are. Storm has picked up, so you'd better run in before you get soaked. If it's too dark in there, be sure to look for light switches. Oh, I almost forgot. Your mother left a box for me somewhere in there. Would you bring it out to me before you head to bed? I'll be waiting right here. Where's the house? Uh, where is the house? That's the road. Alright, maybe it's up here. I do have my glasses on. Oh, this looks kind of creepy. dark in here. Well, they probably are smudged. Which isn't helping my headache at all. But, I actually took, uh, some Tylenol, so hopefully that kicks in here soon. What the heck? Table? I don't know where this, this box is. Knock on the door. You hear what appears to be crying. It is none of your business. I must be really fucking short. <laughs> am I a little kid? How tall am I? <laughs> the, the doorknob is taller than my head. Stay out or face my wrath. That's my room, I think. Oh. <laughs> no, what the heck is out there? Fire. 
burning. Alright, where is this box? I just go to bed. Father wanted you to bring a box out to him. You cannot sleep until he gets it. It should be somewhere in the house. I don't want to look. Ooh, nice. I touched the lamp. Okay, we got some light now. Look, look at how small I am. <laughs> There's a cardboard box on the sofa. Father wants you to bring it out to him. You pick up the box. It's quite heavy. Oh my god. I'm like toddlers. I'm BB10 size. <laughs> All right. Oh, wrong way. Great, you found it. You give Dad the box. Be sure to say hi to your mom for me, okay? And please, be patient with her. She's been through more than any of us. I'd give you a hug, but... I can't let you see my face. It wouldn't be safe. What? Looks like this storm is picking up. You'd better run in and get to bed. I'll be sure to call on Thursday night. Good night. Why wouldn't it be safe? Which my ex excuse? I don't know. Stunted growth. I don't know. Alright, I'm going to bed. Fuck this. You have traveled far today. You are exhausted. Climb into bed and go to sleep. Warning. Oh, the sun is shining. The birds are singing. There's no fire off in the distance. This is going to be a good day. This is your wardrobe. It contains clothes. Alright, let's see if mom's still crying. You knock on the door. There was no answer. There was! Didn't you see the fire out in the distance when I came in at night? I heard crackling of fire. Oh, there's mom. Oh yeah, I'm definitely babby size. Good morning, Leanna. It's me, your mother. Apologies again for my absence last night. I needed to take care of something. I know what you may be thinking. And you don't have to anything to worry about. You're home now. That's the most important thing. But anyway, I do hope you slept comfortably. I understand that you may be feeling a bit confused after your operation. You've been through a lot, Liana. As I'm sure you noticed, your room was kept just the way it was when you left. After all, we wouldn't want to face your wrath, would we? I always loved that little sign on your door. It's so... you. I hope that being back in your own room made you feel a little more comfortable. For today, I think you should just take it easy. Catch up with your dear old mother. First things first, I have prepared breakfast for you. It's over there on the table. It's your favorite. <laughs> kind of, robot mommy. Uh, what's this? It's a pile of goo? Rice? Nutrients? <laughs> Your favorite? <laughs> Just nutrients. You ingested all the nutrients. Where did mom go? Oh, there she is. Uh, 
You ate that whole thing? That's interesting. So I understand that your memory may not be intact after your operation. So I was thinking it could perhaps be helpful if I was to show you around the house. Maybe if you got a tour of the house you grew up in, it could speed up your recovery. Okay, feel free to explore the house. Okay, exploring the house and giving me a tour are two different things. Why is mom's um, thigh showing through? <laughs> is it clipping through her dress? <laughs> yeah, I guess it is. I ate nutrients. Wait, wait. How can mom be in two places at the same time? You are forbidden from touching this record player. It is father's prized possession. But <laughs> I'm not an android. Okay, maybe I am small wonder. Downstairs bathroom has been boarded up. It was broken, so we thought it was best to not let anyone in. I know how much you used to love getting into places you shouldn't be. You must not try to break in there. Then again, it's not like you ever listened to us. You always were a rebellious one. But this is for your own good. After all, we don't want you flooding the place. That would be a nightmare. That's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm breaking it into the bathroom and I'm turning on that faucet, damn it. Anyway, meet me upstairs and we'll check on that brother of yours. I have a brother? You are forbidden from attempting to open this door. Damn it. What's this? You pick up the phone, but nobody's there. You put down the phone. What's this? You flip, it's a, uh, you flip the hallway switch. Okay, I don't know what I'm doing. I got, I don't know. <gasps> Bathroom. Uh, wait. The mirror has been covered with tape. No, I'm, it is for your own good, okay? You do not need to use the sink. Damn it. You do not need to go. Yeah, I do. Honey, oh, I have great news. Your sister is back. Hopefully, and that went too fast. Um, I'm waiting for it to catch up on the other thing. Hopefully this time is good. He's been quiet ever since you got sick. Now he spends all his time on his computer talking with others like him. We never get to talk anymore. And whenever we do, we may as well be speaking another language. It's like he's in a completely different world now. But our boy is very smart for his age, that's for sure. If you ever need advice, I'm sure he won't mind you knocking on his door. He'll never allow you to go in, however. Okay, let's move on. You knock on the door. There was no answer. Alrighty then. Uh-huh. <laughs> what is this? This is the bathroom you'll be using. As I said, the downstairs one is boarded up, and you are forbidden from entering. Also, I hope you don't mind, but I've had to cover all the mirrors. It is, again, for your own good. <laughs> Three m Oh, she's, she's not there. Same one, maybe. And that brings us finally to this door. It leads to mine in your father's room. You are not to enter this door. We keep it locked. But we trust that isn't necessary. We have trust in this family. That concludes our tour. Uh -oh. Alright, I'm going in. I am forbidden from entering mother and father's room. Damn it! Alright. 
I have clothes. What's here? This is your desk. Ah, there we go. We got a light. It is not time to sleep. All right, so what uh, what can I get into? You knock on the door. There was no answer. Do I really have a brother? Hmm. Hmm. Oh, mom is out here. Let's see. <laughs> Leanna, you startled me. You weren't meant to sneak up on me like that. Oh, this? How very special. You always used to love sneaking up and spooking me. Oh, it's starting to look like you're getting back to your old self. Who knows, maybe getting a tour of the house helped recover some of your memories. Okay, tell you what, tomorrow we'll go take a look around the outside of the house. I'm certain that once you see where you grow up, you'll be back to yourself in no time. Does that sound good? Look at this sunset. We used to watch the sun go down together all the time. To tell you the truth, I was worried we'd never get a chance to do it again. Perhaps all the sacrifices we made really were worth it. This one looks especially beautiful though, doesn't it? I don't know if I could actually turn around and look. Come on, it's starting to get cold. It's about time you get to bed. Uh... <laughs> all right. Oh shit! I'm still. Why is there all this? Where where is this water coming from? Like seriously. Is it from that storm? Is it flooding? Hmm. Damn it! I need the key. I don't know. She just left and I was. I don't know. Uh, Alright. Oh, I can turn the light on. Flip the switch on. Now I can see. Can I get in the fridge? The fridge contains food. You do not need to eat. I don't? Maybe Gabby is right and I am an android! I don't know. I don't know what I am. I think I don't think I'm human. I actually, I have a feeling I'm not human. <laughs> no. You knock on the door. There was no answer. Where's the light in here? There's no light. Why? I you you're telling me I gotta pee in the dark. Hug. All right, fine. Where's my oh my god! Liana, our angel. Just one more thing. I've had to do a lot of things that I have regretted. So please, no more, for the sake of this family. Sorry, I had to bring down the mood before bedtime. Oh, it's okay if you hate me. It's normal for girls your age. I just really hope you enjoyed your first day back home. Get some rest. I'll tuck you in. Uh, no. Just like before. I don't- uh, I don't wanna go- That is a creepy ass looking shadow. Alright, fine. You get into bed, and mother tucks you in, just like before. Disengaging! What did it say? Dis disengaging 
consciousness. Disengaging consciousness! Oh my god. I think... I think Gabby's right. I, I'm, I'm a robot. <laughs> my brother's never gonna answer. I don't even know if there is a brother. Oh, good morning, Liana. I hope you're well rested. I may ask you to exert yourself a little more today. Yesterday evening I, evening, I mentioned that I'd show you around the house grounds. Well, I've given it further thought, and I think we simply must do it. If there is any possible chance of getting your memories back, we need to take it. I think it's important for you to know what goes on here. Okay, I'd like you to meet me down by the place we watched the sunset last night. This is a really weird house. Like, seriously, what is with all this water? Ah, you made it! This is our orchard. It means a lot to me. And why is her dress stuck to her arm? <laughs> While you were in hospital, I became very lonely. I never got to see your father. And your brother? He closed himself off entirely. What is going on with the music? Watching you in that hospital bed made me feel so powerless. This orchard became the one place where I felt I had control over what was happening. To have responsibility over the creation of life. It's a divine gift. A gift inherently infused with sorrow and failure. Look at this orchard. You don't see all the heartbreak that was involved in creating such a beautiful life. Creating an environment where they can thrive and come into their own. It takes time. But once you get it right, you'll forget about the hardship that brought you there. Spending your energy on helping them grow only to have to dispose of the failure. That's where our hope comes in. I have hope. Let's continue. Meet me at the path near the side of the house. <laughs> this here, the screen, like the UI, reminds me of like old PS2 like games. Mother is waiting near the graveyard. Like it's giving me uh, shadows of memories or whatever, shadow of destiny, whatever, that kind of vibe. Yeah. Path behind me will take you to the graveyard. Graveyard? We keep the gate locked. I like to go in there every Friday evening. Although we've been growing less fond of going in there lately. With the future as hopeful as ours, I don't feel the need to cling to the past. Not anymore. It's time to move on. With our top tour, I mean. I would hope with our tour. Behind the house, there's one last thing I need to show you. <laughs> the five o'clock news. And, yeah, I can see it a little bit. I don't know if this is where I need to go. Oh. See that barn up there? Well, I, I would if I could look. I truly hope you'll never have to see what's in there. Survival notice. Do not enter the barn. What? I, <laughs> I am a robot! Oh my god. Come on, let's go inside. It's getting late. 
<laughs> Dang it, Gabby! He was right, right at the beginning! Mother has left. I'm going in. Come on! I want to go in the barn! Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> I guess I guess it's fun. <laughs> it is. Okay. Why is she moving at like three FPS? <laughs> By the way, I've been meaning to ask. How was your father doing? You spoke to him when he drove here. Drove you here on Sunday evening, didn't you? Ever since you got sick, he's just buried himself in his work. That's why I barely get to see him these days. He makes a quick visit every Friday night just to see how things are doing. Oh, he's just so determined to make things right. Off to bed with you. I'm getting, well, I'm getting dark. It's getting dark. Well, everything's getting dark. Oh, it's night. Mother has left. Well, I guess it's time for bed. I'm going to the bathroom. Why are all the fun places locked? I've thought of the most marvelous idea. Let's spend a day in the orchard tomorrow. We will get up bright and early and spend a day picking apples until the sun sets. Just like we used to. What do you think? Oh, you always jumped at the opportunity. You and your brother used to love competing to see who could pick the best ones. Don't tell him I said this, but I always thought yours were the best. Speaking of your brother, have you gotten a chance to speak with him at all? I'm certain that he's just as thrilled to have you home as I am. He just shows it in his own way. I hope you felt okay today. Anyway, get to bed. Why was it the creepy music? I'm the one who's the robot. Oh, I'm not allowed to enter this room. She's been feeding you dirt for breakfast, by the way. Not sure what's worse. The fact she tells you it's your favorite, or the fact that you believe her. What? That was my brother? You knock on the door. But, but they were nutrients. Mom said they were nutrients. And, and dirt isn't white. Oh my god. Okay, I, I gotta go to bed. I don't know what he's talking about. I ain't eating no dirt. It's been a long day. But now it is night. And you must sleep to progress. Disengage consciousness. <laughs> Ah, it's a beautiful day. Birds singing, sun shining. This is gonna be a good day. I feel it in my bones. Let's go. <laughs> they can be. You knock on the door. Our dear mother is looking for you downstairs. Better hurry. <laughs> I have... I have mecha I have like metal bones. I have to have some type of skeleton. Good morning. Hope you're ready for a day in the orchard. Better to start bright and early. If you head down there, there's a small shed within the trees. Make your way to that shed and I'll explain what to do. Oh, it'll be just like old times. There's breakfast on the table. If you feel like you need it. <laughs> These are this is a dirt nutrients. 
your favorite. You ingested the nutrients. I, I don't know. I don't think it's a wasteland. Look at this. Look at this beautiful... I mean, we're surrounded by water, but it's beautiful. There was a shed. Oh, how the fuck did you get here? All right, well, let's talk to mom first. You found me. It's always so peaceful out here at this time. A better time to start a hard day's labor. If you get started now, you should be done by the afternoon. Apples should be enough. Just pick up the basket in the shed. Come back and speak to me when it's noon. Oh, my ear is a popping. All right. Picked up the bat. You are now able to pick apples. All right, let's do this. I don't know how I'm going to reach these apples. You pick the apple. That looks like a water balloon. Guys, I'm kind of hungry. <laughs> I didn't have much for lunch. I had uh, a couple of uh, avocado tacos and a sliced apple. That was my lunch. I'm going to make um, homemade minestrone for dinner, though. Well, I have a package, but it's all the ingredients in there, but I have to cook it up. Was that three? I think that was three. Dang it, where are all these apples? How is this an orchard when there's so few apples? Oh my god! Alright, avocados in the U.S. are not expensive. Literally, I got, we were at Aldi, oh, I was at Aldi the other day, and they, they were selling them for like 60 cents a pop. Not, they were they're not that expensive here. No, not in the crock pot, just on the stove, because the recipe calls for this, to cook it on the stove. Alright, where are these? Oh, here's one. I think that's four. Five. Is that another one? No, no. Oh my god, it doesn't take me forever. I think that's six. I like that I could hear the, uh, I could hear the, uh, the, the birds in the, the nature sounds looping. Oh, I think I just need one more. Aha. All right. Where is mom? I think am I lost? Oh my god, I can There it is. Well, look at you go. I'm 
never seen someone get a job done with such determination. You work like your life depends on this. Because it probably does. It's so great being out here in the real world. I'm out here, it makes me feel alive. It connects me to this world. The smell of the fall air, the crunching of the leaves beneath my feet. I didn't have those things, those tangible experiences. Well, it would be nothing more than just another menial task. Something I would do simply to get it over and done with, so I can move on to the next day. Sorry. I often get quite reflective when I'm out here. Anyway, place the basket back on the shelf where you picked it up. Then you should take a rest. You've earned it. Mm-hmm. I don't know, man. You place the basket of apples on the shelf. You take a rest, as per Mother's request. You are now rested. Well, I don't know where she went, but, uh... I gots to get out of here. I think this is the way. I think. Oh wait, there's the path. How do I get to the path? There we go. <laughs> I'm not gonna get probed. Oh my god. You would you have a probe obsession. Seriously. Just ask Cassie. Sorry, I had to rush home. I didn't get a chance to see what you collected. I'll do that later. You worked very hard today, despite not feeling like yourself. You should be proud of that. Get some rest. I don't know what the fuck's going on. Oh. Leanna, can I ask you something? When I talk about these things you used to do when you were younger... You don't remember any of it, do you? It's okay. You don't have to pretend like you do. It's late. I'll speak to you in the morning. Uh, you should get to bed. What? Yeah, she, I don't know if she has an appointment or... She wasn't feeling well. We we helped her get through the next dungeon <laughs> um, in uh, in uh, Final Fantasy XIV last night, though. You knock on the door. You're back from the orchard, yes? Did everything you were told, did you? I see. Well, I'm going to let you in on a little secret, just to save you the surprise. Mother is not happy with you. I'd give her some space if I were you. In fact, she's probably out there right now. But it's best that you just get to bed. Oh, it wasn't streamed. I'm gonna go see where Mom is. I said she's probably out here right now. Well, screw it. I'm gonna find out. Why isn't she happy with me? Man, I'm gonna get lost. What the heck? Okay, that was a little creepy. Rotten. Oh, rotten! Rotten to the core! Alright, same thing. Alright, well, I'm gonna go to bed. Shit, I don't know what's wrong. I don't know why she's pissed. She's got some issues. But I did get an achievement. I'm gonna just lock her out. 
I'm gonna stay out there. Wait. Well, she's messing with the apples. Let me see if I can get in the bathroom. Damn it! <sighs> Can't ever have any fun. No, it's not. Alright, yeah, here we go. Yeah, we, you said the same shit. Alright, come on. You have worked hard today. Mother suggests that you should get some rest. Well, I was supposed to call, call Dad on Thursday night. Alright, well... Hopefully Mom's not all pissed at me. There was no answer. Hmm. Hey, where is she? She's still out there in the orchard? is going on you guys she's still in there mother is seemingly speaking on the phone I just don't know how much longer I can do this all due respect, that's easy for you to say. You're not the one who's stuck here. It's the same thing. Week in, week out. You know, the more you tell me to just be strong, the more it sounds like you don't think I am. Let's face it. We have renounced nature itself. This curse is our punishment. Okay, I need to go. They should be awake any second. See you tomorrow night. I'll leave our bedroom door unlocked tomorrow evening, the same as usual. Oh shit. Well, I don't want her to know that I heard that. Because guess what I'm doing tomorrow? I'm sneaking into mom and dad's room. Oh, I hope I find some good stuff in there. Well, I hope they're not going at it, because that'd be pretty gross. But, I hope I find some good stuff. You knock on the door. Damn it, I bro, I need some help. I'm just gonna go to bed. Can I go to bed? I'm gonna go to bed. You cannot sleep when someone is- What?! You cannot sleep when someone is in your room?! This is your wardrobe. It contains clothes? Hold on. Who's in my room?! What? Is this shit? Is there somebody under the bed? I don't see anything. Uh All right, fine. Guess I got to go find mom again. No. <laughs> you in probings. I seriously. All right. <laughs> I don't know, body aliens. But, uh, I couldn't see so- I don't know. Talk to mom. What is she doing? Are there is- I just- Okay, so we did this all. Okay. Well, I don't know what the hell to do. Alright, yeah. Like, the, the, the sound it makes. 
<laughs> when they talk reminds me of like the adults in the peanuts. You never watched Peanuts? Like the cartoons? Any of the cartoons? And they go, That's how they talk. <laughs> Come on! Go look up Race for Your Life, Charlie Brown. That's my favorite Peanuts uh, movie. Yeah, Snoopy. But the rest of the, of the characters, it was a comic. It was a, um, a newspaper comic for so, I don't know how many years, and it was called Pink Peanuts. And yes, it probably was from like 1950. <laughs> it was uh, by Charles Schultz. Mm hmm. You do not need to watch TV. Well, what the fuck am I supposed to do? You do not need to just sit. What is this? Note from Mother. It's a note for you. Angel, I started to feel unwell last night. I have gone back to bed. Your breakfast is on the table. From Mom. <laughs> I'm not! Snoopy is the character. Peanuts is the entire comic. Oh my gosh. Nutrients, your favorite. You ingested all the nutrients. You wonder what is wrong with mother. Well. I don't know. I don't know where she went. Knock on the door. There was no answer. Why is... Oh, here's Mom. Anna, about yesterday, if I came across as irritated, well, then I am sorry. I hope you can forgive me. I just need to have hope. You're still not well, and it's not fair for me to push you. How selfish I am to think that this is about me. Run along, my angel. I just need to think things through. <laughs> no, I'm not rotten to the core. Mother has disappeared. The phone. Maybe it's dad. We pick up the phone. Hello? Leanna? It's you, isn't it? It's your father. I told you I'd call. So how's my little angel doing? I'm as busy as I've ever been here at the office. I have a good feeling about this next thing I'm working on. I really think this could be the one. Hey, can't you see I'm on the phone? What do you mean to who? To my wife, of course. What's it to you anyway? Sorry about that. Certain people are starting to get too far too interested in my business. Okay, where was I? Oh yes, there's a reason I called. Other than the fact that I said I would, of course. Your mother rang me from the orchard this morning. She told me that things aren't going too well. I am so sorry to hear that. I just hope you know that it's nothing to do with you. It's just... been through hell lately. I'll be coming to visit her tomorrow night. As much as I'd love to be able to spend time with you, it's just not safe for either of us. Anyway, try not to fight it, will you? Goodbye. Put down the phone. <gasps> okay, well, whatever. That man's optimism. There's a night! She's gonna leave the door open! 
It's not often you see a man's greatest strength also become his greatest weakness. While he may have lost many things, his hope is not one of them. The hell is, the hell is that? Why are there... Why am I seeing, like, writings? What the hell? I don't know what that is. Alright, but... But... Guess what? I'm sneaking. No! Come on! Man, damn it, bro! Come outside. There is something I need to show you. No, I need you to show me. Her, but you know, whatever. It's freaking dark. What is that writing? <laughs> no, come on. Are there multiple endings to this? have been cold lately. Have you noticed? These are the kinds of nights that inspire gratitude in having a home like ours. This one feels especially chilly, though, doesn't it? I want you to walk directly towards the moon. You'll meet me out by the roadside. Why am I walking towards the moon? Here we are. This is as far as you can physically go. I want you to do something for me. I need you to show me. I need to know. But I know you will. Show you what? Here we are. This, uh, I, I don't know. Oh, I want you to sleep here tonight. I need you to show me. I need to know. I, but I know you will. I get to sleep here. I'm pretty sure she opened the door Thursday night. I I don't know. She wants me to sleep here. Other wishes for you to sleep here tonight. You lie on the ground and wait until morning. All right. I don't know what the heck's going on, you guys. Okay, but I need to get into the bedroom. <laughs> Why isn't she doing anything? I assume you're well rested. What? Error, no dialogue, no di- What? 
Your breakfast is on the table. You don't have to eat it. But right now, it seems like your only choice. Uh, what the heck? All right, mother says this is your favorite. Okay. Report to mother for your next objective. First, I'm gonna go talk to bro, if he'll even talk to me. Uh, no answer. Damn it. I will allow you into the graveyard. Just for today. Okay. Uh, the graveyard's this way, right? Error, 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 error. What? You must not proceed. You must not proceed. You. Oh, oh my gosh. I must proceed. What? I, I, I don't know. Why is it mosaic? object has been mental blocked to prevent any potential conflict. Are you sure you wish to continue? Mental block removed. Observing this object may lead to a core conflict. A core conflict may cause memory leak. We demand the immediate servicing of any unit shown to suffer a core conflict. Are you sure you want to continue? Left click to continue. <laughs> All right. Liana's grave. Our angel. We will never give up on you. Continue. It says something about continued exposure. I'm going to keep exposing myself to this. Said something about report to Enig Enigma Technologies. Alright, I don't know this one. This. Alright, it just goes too fast. I'm trying to read it. Alright, well. this make you feel? You can speak if you like. Mom, is that you? You don't have anything to say? Hello, can you hear me? I'm here. That's okay. You don't have to say anything if you don't want to. Why can't you hear me? Am I dreaming? I must go inside. Your father is coming to visit and I need to prepare for his arrival. Dad? He's here too. Please go to bed. What is going on? You're probably wondering what's going on. Okay, we'll talk about what just happened in the morning. <laughs> you feel a drop of water run down your face. Aw, I cried. Because I'm dead. Like, D-E-D, -D, dead. What is going on up in that room? Hear what appears to be arguing. It isn't any of your business. Dang it!
Don't mind those two. This happens every week. It's like they're living in different worlds entirely. There's like writing! I, I, I don't know what that is. It's been a long day, but now it is night. And you must sleep to progress. Disengaging consciousness. Hey, Kazea! <laughs> I think I'm a robot. And BB10 is convinced I'm getting probed. Oh! You're awake! Angel, you're not well. I just wanted to tell you that you can stay in your room today. I don't need you to do anything for me. Your father will be here to pick you up tomorrow evening. So, until then, just wait in here, okay? We're doing everything we can to help you. You know that, right? That's my good girl. Oh, uh, what? Core objective. Be with mother. Can't get in the bathroom yet. Uh, hey, Deadpool. Uh, not much. Angel, you startled me. I told you to stay in your room. Please. It's for your own good. There is hiding. Oh, my nutrients. Mother says this is your favorite. I'm gonna adjust those. Alright, so where's mom? Get in. <gasps> There's a wit. Hold on. That picture is a wit frame. She's been watching me all this time. What's this? A closet? This is a creepy ass looking room. Knock on the door. There was no answer. I don't know. I'm pretty sure I'm a robot though, and I died, and my dad created me to help mother, my mother, or whatever, uh, deal with the grief. But she's like freaking the fuck out. I don't know where she is now. She's not here. Where the heck is she? Is she in the graveyard? Hmm. I think she sent me in the graveyard on purpose. Because she wanted me to break down. she in the barn? She said never to go to the barn. <gasps> Wait! Was that burning on the day that I came? Was that... Was that the previous... <laughs> Leanna getting burned? Oh, she's not there. You saw in the graveyard last night. Please, try not, try not to let it get to you. We're doing everything we can to help you. I 
Please listen. I prefer for you to not do anything. Just quit. You're scaring me. Uh, poor objective. Be with mother. Oh man, I didn't get up here yet. No, Is she up there? No. I think my uh, programming is skitzing out. Like, look at there's that writing again. I, I hold on. Oh, core objective be with mother. So I see. I think that that. Yeah, I can see it now. Um, that writing I've been seeing in the different distance must be my my programming. <sighs> yep. Now I can read it. Stay back! What do you want from me? I don't have anything for you to do! Just leave me alone! You knock on the door. There was no answer. Okay, this is this is this is like I don't even know what this is. Where the heck is she? She's not upstairs. Yeah, but it's hard to follow the text because I don't know where it is. No, the text is still in the bathroom. See? She's not here anymore. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Cannot sleep when someone is in your room. <laughs> Yeah, there's... Ah, there we go. Ah, uh, shit. I think I gotta go up here. Ugh. All right, it's got to be this way. There it is. Yes, ugh. I'm going to ugh if I want to, damn, damn it. <laughs> ugh, yes. <laughs> Let's see. Don't die. As you can see, there is nothing out here for you. But that's not why you're doing this, is it? I'm not your mother. I think you know that. You're just using me to pass the time. That's the only reason you're here, in this world. I know what I must do. Uh-oh. <laughs> she is gonna kill me! I did nothing wrong! Leanna did nothing wrong. She just existed and mother just freaking the fuck out and she's just gonna kill me. 
You know what? All dad wanted to do was to help mom cope with my death, and now she's just gonna murderize me. This isn't fair. <laughs> Maybe. If we, if I could. Mother. Angel, you're not well. Your father will be here to pick you up tomorrow night. He's been working as hard as he can to help to get you better. We took you home before you were ready. You're no different to the apples in that basket behind me. I'm so sorry. You are to stay in this shed until your father gets here tomorrow night. I am going to close the door behind you. You are forbidden from opening it. This is the only way. You may not understand, but please, trust me when I say that this is for your own good. Don't make us go through all of this again. Quit. Now. Uh-oh. You are forbidden, forbidden from opening this door. Core objective. Be with mother. No! I-I-I need to- Come on! I gotta get out of here. These apples have had their cores cut out. You're no different to the apples. That is what Mother said. Mother would never say such a thing. They've started to rot. Core objective, be with Mother. But, but... Core objective unreachable? Functional stalemate reached. Unable to progress. Contingency. Initialize backup core. I want to be with mother. I want to get out! You were unable to get out. Why? Mother said you were forbidden, forbidden from opening this door. But I want to see her! Affirmative. Core objective. Be with mother. I need to open this door. Opening this door is forbidden. I will open this door. I will open this door. I open the door. Core disconnected. Automatic control resumed. Be with mother. So am I the monster? <laughs> I, I think I'm the monster. That's okay. If I'm the monster, I'm gonna be the best monster I can be. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it kinda does. <laughs> oh man, where's the house? I can't see. There's so much, uh. Oh, so much fog. Let's go see what bros. Oh my god! Son? Keep your door closed at all costs, okay? It's only staying for one more night. There's nothing to be afraid of. Just. Not open your door to her, no matter what. You'll be safe as long as you don't let her- Stay back! We don't want anything from you! Just stay away from us! Whoever you are, leave this family alone! Mother, it's me, Liana. I must call out to Mother. You attempt to call out to Mother. Can she hear me? But you do not make a sound. Insufficient PC synchronization. She do 
is not here. You, you must try again. You attempted to call out to mother. I call out to mother. Did it just speak? Honey, stay in your room. Contamination is beginning. Isn't this exactly what you wanted to happen? Oh, I don't know who's speaking. Not like this. There's not a little girl in there. It's it's something else entirely. Oh, it's brother talking. What do we do? It needs an objective. Without a purpose, it will hunt us until it's got it gets one. I told it to wait in the shed until your father arrived, but contamination is already setting in. I'm going to try to give it another order. Leanna. Angel. Wait here until morning. are not her. Yeah, I know. Player core desynchronization in effect. Liana, you are not Liana, you're not her. Okay. What am I? You are not you. Door is knocked upon. this anymore. I want nothing more to do with any of this. There's my nutrients. She made me breakfast again. I do not need to eat. I refuse. Dignit, I want to go up to the barn. No, it's it wasn't. It's nutrients. I don't know what it was. Brother said, bro said it was dirt. This is why I'm small. Yeah. I don't know where she is. Am I supposed to go meet dad? think she's in here. Well, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. It just says I am not me. Maybe I should go back to the graveyard. Yeah, Nixia says go back to the graveyard. <laughs> I, I wish. I can't believe I'm so short. <laughs> I mean, I know I'm short in real life, but this is ridiculous. Nope, can't go to the graveyard either. Well, shit. Being sure can have its perks. I want to go in here, though. Let me go in. Oh, man, I don't know. I do not eat, any but I want to eat. Can I watch TV? This is like BB 10 short, seriously. Like, look, look at this. Well, I think I'm just gonna. Well, I am getting kind of, kind of, you know, munchy. I'm getting, I'm getting a hankering for something. Ah, <sighs> you cannot sleep when someone is in the room. Know who is in the room? All right, I don't know what I'm. 
um, I'm supposed to do. I can't. Jay boarded up the mirrors. Nope, I don't think she's out here either. I don't know where to go. Like back behind the house? Uh, nothing. Yeah, she's just that way. I don't know. Are there, like, multiple endings to this game? I don't know. I don't have a... Mm. Alright, I've been everywhere I could possibly go to see... Well, maybe she's... The one last place is out by the... I guess through this water. Three endings? over here. I don't think I've ever been over here. Oh, it's a tunnel. I'm sure I'm looking in every place except the one place that she is. Oh, I can actually go underwater. I just want Dad to come pick me up. Like, seriously. This has been a nightmare. Mom is just freaking the fuck out. All I want to do, I, all I want is love. It just, my objectives, if, objective is you are not you. That's all it is. This cabinet is used for storing various ceramics for dining. Cleaning products. You have no reason to interact with this. A plate of dirt. I will not eat it. You cannot make me eat. Oh, I guess I had to keep. I kept trying to eat that uh, the dirt. No, I will not. You pick up the phone, Angel. It's me. It's your father. Listen, I know things are probably very confusing for you right now, but you need to trust us. I'll be over tonight to pick you up. Just try not to lose your head until then. When we last spoke, I mentioned that your mother called me from the orchard on Thursday morning, and she mentioned you were feeling sick. Well, we're doing everything we can to help you. We cannot do that unless you cooperate. My research has come such a long way this week. You're already showing signs of improvement, so I really think you'll do better next week. Anyway, I'm just getting in my car now. We have a long drive ahead of us, so we'd better get going. See you soon. Please, try not to fight it. Eat up. Put down the phone. Eat up. What the fuck is wrong with her eyes? Good morning, Angel. I made you breakfast. It's for your own good. Mm -hmm. 
Uh, she's. I think she's trying to poison me. Okay, it's just the same stuff. Uh, do I have to eat it? Can I just go to bed? Decide to eat it, even though I don't want to. You are not in control. You cannot make me eat. Disgusting. It was filth. I don't want to eat it. Oh my god. Alright, uh, where is she? Not long now. The kitchen knife? <laughs> I need to, need to get a kitchen knife? Is that what I need? I, I think so. The cabinet is well. It's telling me to get a knife. Trinkets, pots. Look, if it's telling me to get a ch kitchen knife, I need to get a kitchen knife. There we go. The kitchen knife. The kitchen knife. <laughs> I obtained the kitchen knife. It's time to end this. this? It's a note for Leanna. Hi, Leanna. I hope you made it home safely. Sorry I'm not there to greet you. I haven't been feeling well the past few days, so I had to go to bed early. I'll make it up to you in the morning. Love, Mom X. Alright, well. It is stabbing time. Actually, let's go up and see Bro first. Even though, I don't even know if he's in here. It is! Because all that matters is stabbing. Oh. Does not open for you. There's a there's a door right there. I think we're, we're finally able to go to the barn. I don't know. What the? Oh, come on! I was just about to get to the barn. Okay, here we go. The hell? It's a huge-ass chasm. <laughs> oh, that it is, BB-10. That it is. Box is empty. I knew you'd eventually make your way up here. What's that you got? Ah, good. You brought it. Give me the knife. Now's our chance. Kill her. No! I had Mother the Knight? That's a good girl. What? No, no, no! Now, 
Let's watch the sunset. Why did you hand it over? Why did you give it to her? Go on. Get as close as you can. Core objective. It's time to end this. That isn't what I meant. I knew you'd eventually make your way up. Okay, blah, blah, blah. Alright, so we did this already. I didn't want to have this conversation. Oh, that's Mother. But if there's any semblance of a you in there... I feel I at least owe it an explanation. None of this was your fault. You only did what was possible within your means. That's just the way this world was presented to you. In fact, I can only assume that the way I appear to you is just as unnatural as the way you appear to me. Angel, whoever you are, we exist in two separate realities. We can both continue to play our respective roles. We can both pretend that we have a connection, a shared experience. But it will never be a replacement for something authentic. Just as I will never be your mother, you will never be my daughter. You will never be her. And that's okay, because once you find your core, you can be whoever you want. Feel Mother place her hand on top of your head. Would you look at that? Isn't it beautiful? I come up here every Sunday evening to watch it. I wouldn't miss this sunset for the world. Mom? Core disconnected from player! She's cutting her head off! Why is this happening? <laughs> I lost my head, literally. Hey, didn't your did my dad basically say that that, that not to lose your head? <laughs> Rebooting. Click to continue. Core disconnected from player. There's a storm approaching right on cue.